How's it going everyone? JKXVX here. We're back on Forza Horizon 5 once again with another video. As you may know, Xbox were very kind enough to give me the chance to play a preview version of Forza Horizon 5, sort of a single player only version. It was a bit unfinished, such as the car list within the build I played still isn't final. But nevertheless, with my time with the game, I spent tons of time doing tons of videos for you guys. So make sure to subscribe because over the next few weeks, there's going to be tons of Forza Horizon 5 videos. Now, something that's been in every Forza title so far is what you see in the title and thumbnail. Wheel spins. Super wheel spins. And as you guessed it, Forza Horizon 5 has wheel spins. Every time you level up and blah, 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 you can get them as rewards. Now, while I had the version of the game, I recorded all of my wheel spins and all of my super wheel spins. And we've got them in a little bit of a compilation in today's video just so you can sort of see what the wheel spins look like, what the rewards are, what the odds look like, and so on. Now, the most favourable ones are obviously the super wheel spins, so that's what we're going to start with. I'm going to start rolling them now. Now, in my personal opinion, the wheel spins are much better in Horizon 5. Not only do the odds seem a bit better, but if you're sick of getting clothes, you can sort of dedicate to buying all of the clothes through the customization menu, which you now can, can do. And if you've bought all the clothes, you then don't get them in wheel spins, making your odds to get a car or credits even better. The only complaint I would have about super wheel spins or wheel spins in general is they don't look very redesigned. They still look sort of similar to before. I'm not really that bothered. It's quite a nice design anyway, to be honest. I don't know if it was just my look, but my super wheel spins and my wheel spins were great. Anywhere up to 300,000 credits can be gained in wheel spins as usual. I believe you may be able to get a million credits again once you get all the clothes possibly like the last game. And as you've probably seen scroll past, Forza Edition cars can be gained through wheel spins as well, but not all of them. There are some Forza Edition cars which are restricted to the VIP pass. Some of them are restricted to rewards, so you can't get them in wheel spins and so on. So in this game, you can't just grind wheel spins to get all the Forza Editions. You have to work somewhere else to get them. Again, not an issue. I think that's kind of cool. Now, in my experience, there were nine Forza Editions that you could get in wheel spins, three of which you couldn't drive because they're in the VIP pass. I don't know if that'll be in the game at release. Again, it was very unfinished, not quite final, but that was my personal experience. So chances are throughout this video, you'll see about nine Forza Editions won through the wheel spins. I don't know how many super wheel spins are left, but if there's any left, I'm just gonna leave the video rolling and I'm gonna stop talking just so you can have a quick look at them. And then we'll get to a ton of normal wheel spins. That's all of the super wheel spins I had. Now I have literally hundreds of standard wheel spins. I'm not gonna be able to put them all in this video, so I'm gonna have to speed it up. Just again, for the satisfaction of it, I guess, you can see the odds, you can see what wheel spins look like. And again, once with, with normal wheel spins, the odds just seem a lot better. Once you finally get all of the clothes, or just buy them, if you're sick of winning them, um, you can genuinely get pretty good stuff. There are a lot more horns in this game compared to others. Um, video on my channel of all of the horns, actually. So there are more horns to win, there's more emotes to win as well, but they're all pretty good. And car-wise, it seems very balanced. Now, on Horizon 5, super wheel spins can be gained from leveling up past milestones, such as prestiging, level 100, and blah, 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 blah. They can be gained from the car mastery sort of section where you sort of use your perk points or skill points. And I didn't experience this myself because I played a single player only version, but no doubt they can be um, gained through the festival playlist for certain challenges like that. As for normal wheel spins, exactly the same thing. Car mastery, 
Um, every time you level up, you get a normal wheel spin, as you know. You can also win normal wheel spins through the car collections menu as well. For example, if you collect all of the Hondas, you may get a wheel spin and other bits like the festival playlist and blah, blah, blah. So they're not hard to get. Anyway, I'm just going to let a load of normal wheel spins just fly on the screen right now. It's going to be quite sped up, but you'll still be able to see what rewards I got. Once again, if you have any questions, let me know in the conversation below. Leave a like if you've enjoyed, guys. Enjoy the rest of the wheel spins. See you later.